<laughs> Just like the Battle of Salamis, Captain. I have you trapped. <laughs> Here comes Themistocles. And that is the game. Oh! Ramodo! Foxy, that's why are we delivering all this treasure? We could retire to Lesbos with this amount of gold. <laughs> what say you, desert rat? If that chest doesn't make it to Pompeii, this ship won't either. We crawl through Hades to deliver it if we have to. Enough. Back to work, you slack vlakos! Demestis! My trusted shield boy, get to it, huh? We've been hired to bribe Pompeii, to save a queen, and to win a kingdom. <laughs> the usual fare for us mercenaries, huh? I see the scaries. Your third voyage? And already you bark like a commander. <laughs> I enjoy watching Spittle get caught in your beard, Foxy Das. Let's not be thrown oh, into the speed. sea. That's no death for such a hero as me. A real hero could swim to save himself. I see them and not be sucked to a scupper for nothing. Now you're just speed trying to impress me. The horizon there. Those colors are not from Rome. What mess has this boxy queen dragged us into? Ptolemy's ships, sent by the order of ancients, no doubt. What business do they have with Pompeii? Pompeii's armies will give Cleopatra the throne. They mean to prevent the alliance before it happens. We must hurry. Poseidon's peace. The air is already choked with smoke. The seas will steam near the volcano. We should keep our distance if we don't want to burn. Is that Methana? She hasn't burst for hundreds of years. It wouldn't surprise me if she... Ready ourselves! Let's show these traitors they chose the wrong pharaoh! Be 
got these Malakias! Target their little wings! They're full of oil! They'll burn like camel sheep! Now! Call for ramming speed! Got them like fish! Oh, no, no! Change for kings or queens. I left my wife and kids behind for the same reason. No one sane accepts me. I accept you. We accept you. Allah! These hundred Nauta is enough acceptance for me. It's hard to say goodbye to those who don't accept us. But it is also the only way. Is it? Pompey will be at the appointed place off Terra's coast. Sail on! Patrols ahead. Are you ordering me away from a fight? Hey, shit! Of course not. But I am not keen to die protecting a Roman, especially one who can afford his own protection. You know, you really should join this priory. You'd feel prepared. Firebombs ready! Call for them when we pull near!
Civil war in Egypt and a mercenary trireme comes to my aid. In the midst of war with Caesar, I find it odd. Who in Hades are you? Well, we could have let you die. Pompeius Magnus. Greetings and friendship from Queen Cleopatra. Cleopatra offers gold to win my favor once I've won Rome. Is that what friendship means to your queen? Whose face graces that coin? Do Roman women receive the same honor? An alliance with Cleopatra is a union of true power. She wants more than an ally. She seeks a king. Hmm. A valuable friendship indeed. Agreed. My fleet will soon be ready for Egypt. Captain Foxidas, the magnificent Greek mercenary who single-handedly defeated the despised Gabiniani in epic ba You said Goddess of Siwa? What was her name? Which battle are you talking about? You have not had! Oh, my friend, then you are in for a treat! Let me tell you how it happened! Legend has it! The noble Greek captain and the Egyptian goddess sailed from Alexandria's Golden Coast in search of the feared Gabiniani fleet. With only their sturdy trireme and loyal crew against the Gabiniani's fabled warships. Floating mountains, carrying 10,000 men, bristling with oars and fire. Where are these mongrel Gabinianis? My informant assured me they would pass here. A throttle is scrawny neck if he told me wrong. Who are the Gabiniani? Where do they come from? Exiles of Rome who took Egypt as their home. Traitorous rats, everyone. The discipline of Rome, the ruthlessness of Ptolemy. Worthy opponents for the likes of us. Well, we have to stop them before they can join Ptolemy's fleet. We'll find them, I. And send them to ruin. Not one of this song. There! Is that the whole fleet? Poseidon's peace, no, woman. That's only part of their full strength. The lesser part by the looks. Trireme's only. No sign of their damned octory. This works in our favor. We can work them down, ship by ship. Strike us and ready your boards. We attack! Give no quarter, men! These devils will give us none! We have an obstetric! How will we face it? Show no fear, Damastis! They've not met our kind before! They've floated bars to save them! Our men coming! Our tempo! Our damage speed! Speed up! Very speed! Easy pay! Ready! Our, our speed! Shadow! Our tempo! Speed up! Ready! Taking aim! Give them hell of a threat! Give them hell of a threat! Arrows incoming! Ray! More speed! Ray! Need more speed! Ray! Off the tempo! Don't do harder! Ready! 
So many. You must not doubt me. I was told it by someone who saw it happen. Captain, we bested them. The Gabinelli are finished. Don't be hasty, boy. My spies gave me a greater number than that. They must have split their fleet. We should head east. Straight into the jaws of the crocodile, if your spies tell the truth. <laughs> what of it? I've wrestled more fearsome beasts. And none were a match for our captain! <laughs> your bravado would be your undoing, captain. And ours. From the very depths of the underworld, a second bristling wall of hulls appeared. This time, an unbelievable 40 Gabiniani death ships faced our lone heroes. Then another ship rose behind the fleet, the size of which has never been seen before or since. 10,000 warriors crowded its massive deck, smashing sword and spear against the present ship. They fought like gods. But it was all to no avail. Yet, more ships appeared! A vast burning armada of war bore down upon them, as if sent from Mars himself. The crew fainted, but were borne up again by the wild, thunderous cries of their fearless captain and the goddess. Yet more ships from the east! It is false! This must be the fault out of these bastards! There! Gods and beasts! This is it, slackers! We win, or we die! Ah, la, la. Prepare to evade! Gaia! They must this! Slackers all, listen to me! Scribes will break their pens, writing of this day! On this blood-smeared ocean, we'll send these cursed and Gabriani! To the underworld! Let's see them tell that story without tears running down their faces! 
Over the backs of ten times ten thousand drowned Gaviniani. I tell you, I weep just to tell of it. And they say, if you whisper a prayer into a wave or a fold of the sea, you can hear the war cry answer back. Alala! Alala! And that is how it happened. To a word. What a tale. The goddess' name was Aya, and a goddess she truly is. That may be the only honest part of the story. What is truth? All is permitted in the realm of greatness. One must believe in the act of creation, or else they will join the Gabiniani. You are a fine storyteller, Seni. Though, I cannot tell if you are playing a game with me, or telling a story. They are one and the same, my friend. Married to each other. Like the oceans and the rain. Alala! You see it now! Ha 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 ha!